happy December, everybody. I wanted to just jump on um, and just talk to you for a minute and say hello. I actually have like a bunch of bits and bobs and just have a chat, let you know what's been happening here. And I actually probably pull some jewelry out of some candles because these are, I'm just dying to do it. Um, it's like an Amazon day, I think, today. Um, Ro and I are doing 12 days, well 12, 24 days. Oh, oh no. Fire, that's why it's a dangerous hazard. 24 days of <laughs> advent calendaring. He's laughing at me. Um, so check that out on the channel as well. Every day we're gonna do a new science experiment from the advent calendar, um, which is an Amazon find. I found that there. I also found this um, pink hot chocolate that apparently changes color. I don't know. So um, I am gonna make it and I'm gonna talk to you guys. Um, let's see. Um, oh gosh. And I also dumped this whole thing of marshmallows all over the floor. And Rowan also laughed at me then, um, which is fair because it was hilarious. Uh, and I just felt really foolish. So here we go. It's gonna go in. It looks like it's white chocolate now. I'm putting it in this cup, I'm going to stir it so that you can see it and see if it actually changes color. And then I'll put it in the cute cup because it's got a unicorn on it. So, oh my gosh, it is changing color. <gasps> it's going to be pink! Stop it, it started white and now it's going to be pink. Well, that's fun and exciting. And so, this is a really exciting Christmas holiday season for me. Personally, it's been 10 years since I've been with my parents on a holiday, not a holiday, on a, for a holiday season. We celebrate Ukrainian Christmas. We also celebrate the one on the 25th, but mostly the one I'm most attached to is Ukrainian Christmas. So our Christmas is actually in January. Um, but I've been out of the country and working on cruise ships or at Disney World for the last 10 years. So I haven't been home um, or with my family. And, really good looking okay guys can I can I do you think I can pour it into this cup without yeah nailed it mm. well mostly nailed it mm. I made that with oat milk and a little bit of chai latte um, yeah big fan good talk so this is a super exciting year for me personally to be here to be in Canada with my parents and sister and to also have Rowan my partner with me because this is his first holiday season with who will be his in-laws and um, in Canada and there's just so many that's me putting marshmallows in so many things to be grateful for amongst in amongst a crazy crazy year i know it's been just bonkers it's been bonkers 2020 and the end of 2019 so i'm always looking for positives and one of the positives is yes time spent with my family this cup is not easy to sip from should i put it back in the big cup but look how cute. I really like one of the fun aesthetics of like hot chocolate cup with a unicorn on it. Woo! But I'm probably gonna burn my face. So here it goes again. Okay. All right, okay, enough. Enough, enough with playing with this now. So that's something we're really excited about. And just making sure there's not too much floor on these. And we've been doing really fun. <clears throat> hey, we've been doing really fun things like decorating, helping my sister decorate her house.
And the other day we did our lights on the trees. And then at night when the sun goes down, you can really see them, they kind of like pop. So it's that. It's been a lot of fun. Um, I'm also doing um, a 12 day of yoga challenge with my dear friend that I worked with on cruise ships, Gigi Geraldine, Gigi Yoga. I'll link her below as well. Um, I, I love how I feel after I do yoga. I'm always, I, I really like like boxing and running and hit intervals and lifting heavy things and jump rope and throwing things around. Um, and I'm riding horses every day right now and it is so much fun but it's quite, my, my body gets quite sore and as much as I love yoga and I love how I feel, if you're like, hey, do you want to do some yoga? I'm like, uh, snore, no, boring. I want to go like run fast and jump off things and hit stuff. Uh, but I know that I'm going to feel really good. So I'm really, all I needed was Gigi to be like, yoga challenge. And now I'm like, cool, okay, I can do yoga. So that's probably a character flaw that I should work on. But for now, I'm just going to do yoga and see how it goes. And um, also, like, I don't know. If anyone else is finding this, my insomnia, I have really bad insomnia. Um, and it has been, I mean, it's not getting worse. That's in the, this whole being on land and having quarantine business, I've really been working on my sleep. And it is a struggle. Like a, a cool breeze wakes me up. And for the first time in my whole life, I've now been sleeping for like five hours straight, which is, incredible like that's something that's never happened but I constantly have to fight it because I honestly feel like I'm just so tightly wound most of the time I would rather like not sleep or eat and I just want to like watch YouTube and watch Netflix all night long and I know you're like you're foolish just do that in the daytime but in the daytime I want to go running around and like riding horses and being outside and and living daytime life so really I understand that I'm fallible and that I'm a human and that I need sleep and food to function, but I don't want to do it. So that's my struggle. But I've really been focusing on it for the last five months, six months, and I'm really in a better place. So I'm, that's something I've been working on. Um, and I just, I guess just right now as it's colder, I'm feeling twitchier and I just have a hard time winding down. So that is something I'm working on. Um, let me know if that's something you also struggle with. I don't know. I think it's also probably quarantine. Like, this is a crazy time and it's throwing everybody's schedules off. So, I'm just gonna keep working on it. And, uh, yeah, working on that. Okay, so we did yoga, sleep, hot chocolate, burning my mouth. Hmm. Yeah, all good things. Are these candles ready to go? Let's pull some jewelry out of some candles. I really like this one. Of course, these are from Charmed Aroma. This one um, smells really good. And I, usually, most of them are clear, as you've probably seen. So you can kind of see when the jewelry is coming. And I get really like, haha, it's coming now. This one, you couldn't see it. And I got like nervous. I was like, Where's my jewelry? Is it coming? I'm so confused. It gave me like a lot of feelings and emotions, but of course because Charmed Aroma loves me. The jewelry's here, so not to worry, guys. Ooh. Not to worry. This is definitely one that I'm gonna keep um, later and put, I don't know, shiny things in it. Who knows, more shiny things. So, da 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 da. Digging jewelry out with my fingers. Even though everybody tells me not to. Wiping wax on this paper. Oh. Um, this is a special ornament. This one I think was supposed to be like a Swarovski business dealio. Where are the scissors? There we go. Da 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 da. Um, I've also been, we've been working a lot on like filming TikTok videos and filming content for, um, 
Instagram, which I'm really loving, and that's why I'm in these uh, onesies. So make sure you give me a follow on Instagram, follow along. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. My engagement ring is gonna be really mad, but don't worry. <laughs> Look how shiny. Come on, focus. Nope, not gonna. Okay, well, it's really. Hey, there we go. Really beautiful. Um, nice, like, Swarovski. Oh, yeah. This one is from the Disney collection, and I thought this one was further along, so I might burn myself doing this. No, ow, no, ow. Ow! Yeah, fun Disney collection. Let's get the candles out. Get the wax out. Um, as I'm doing this, so just, yeah, I just wanted to kind of jump on, say hi. Um, I also want to know what you guys want from this channel, what you want to see um, as far as content goes, like what are you liking so far. Um, I'm really trying to, you know, have a channel of the people, so whatever you guys want to see is what I want to do. I've got a lot more travel videos coming up from our old travels. Um, obviously Christmas is a lot of fun content, so I'm really getting excited to do all this kind of stuff for you guys. And yeah, let me know. Let me know in the comments. Um, please, oh gosh. You want me to flail candle? Whoa. Okay, my hands are covered in wax, but look at that. Come on. Can you see it? Oh my gosh, guys, it's so shiny. This one looks like a proper like engagement ring. Curses. Okay, I'm gonna burn my hair if I'm not careful. Um, yeah, I'm gonna wash the wax off of this one and it's real shiny. So yeah, drop us a comment. Drop me a comment below. Let me know what you're liking, what you wanna see more of, if you have any questions, if you want me to do more of like you want me to tell you my process and how I've been working on my sleep? I am not any kind of licensed therapist, doctor, sleep analyst, biohacker. I have no qualifications. I can only tell you what's worked for me and what might work for you and what I've read um, and cite my sources and all that stuff. So let me know. Give us a thumbs up and a like. That's the same thing. Um, Please subscribe and share and tell your friends. That really, really helps me here on this channel grow and grow with you guys. So, um, happy holidays. Oh, I was gonna do like a really nice like, <laughs> like cheers moment. Um, but my hands are covered in wax. So like... That's probably something from the floor where I dropped all of the marshmallows. Disgusting. I'm still gonna drink it. I vacuumed that floor yesterday, it's fine. All right, thanks guys, have a wonderful day and happy season, happy holidays, happy whatever you celebrate. Happy Thursday, I don't know what day it is. Happy you.